first farmer's market of the season, and it oh. couldn't have been a better day. It was just perfect. It was sunny, and the weather was not too hot. It was sunny in 60, mm-hmm. and then by the time we got done with our day, it was sunny in 70. Right, right. It was a little just crowded, great. but I don't mind that too much. Okay, but now the farmer's market, go. They sort of, eh, they've sort of moved it over a little bit, I think, yeah. right? So it's still on Memorial. Mm-hmm. It goes all the way from Broadway to the parking lot on D Street. Right. Basically where the little commemorative boulder is. In fact, here's the farmer's market in 24 seconds. If you're watching on video, we'll start with the boulder that basically states the farmer's market is every Saturday, May through October. Mm -hmm. And you can see the water tower in the background. Get out of my way, people. Just kidding. I had to do a quick shot of the puppy butt. (laughs) <laughs> Until I realized I might be being, being creepy. <laughs> and then I walked almost all the way to Broadway and there it was. Yeah. Let me show you this too. I did notice the river's pretty high this year. Remember when we were talking right. about the possibility of flooding? Don't think that's going to happen. Oh. But look how high it is. I'll try to zoom in on this crappy video there. You you kind of get the idea. I'll yeah. try to get a better one for you. But it's impressive to see that much water come oh, over yeah. the falls. Oh, yeah, yeah, for sure. I mean, I was even at the falls and was looking out, and I could tell it was higher than usual. Mm-hmm. But overall, I love the farmer's market, and I was very strategic this year. Oh. Um, so for one thing, all winter long, I've been craving some quail eggs. Yes. So I did go a-hunting for those pretty early on. Unfortunately, they were all sold out. I was super bummed. <laughs> but I also very specifically made sure to bring my picnic basket with a nice big thick ice pack in the bottom of it uh, so that anything I did buy would stay nice and cool because we decided to go straight from the farmer's market to the Cinco de Mayo celebration. Uh huh. And I didn't want any of my delightful, delicious artisanal cheeses to spoil. <laughs> <laughs> I got two different ones. I got a strawberry chevra and I got a Yellowstone. I believe it's a cheddar. I'm very excited. And what's the bread you got this time around? That looks interesting. Oh, yeah. So I got the dill cottage cheese bread. And then right. I also got, I think it's a pesto brioche. I don't remember exactly, but it smelled real good. Brunch, baby. I know. I'm so excited. <laughs> Brunch at Carly's. Mm hmm. 